Hey there, in this video, I'm gonna give you a quick overview of how a supplier responds to an RFQ that they've received from the QLM sourcing solution. The supplier will get an email, it looks somewhat like this, although the wording of the email can be configured by each of the QLM customers. But the most important thing that the supplier will get is an attachment to the email, which is the RFQ form itself. And the key thing about accessing this RFQ and or the RFQ form and being able to make your submission is to open this correctly. So in a lot of cases, in today's world, people will use browser-based email clients such as Google Mail or other uh, tools that, that work in, the, in a web environment. A lot of those, uh, a lot of those tools leverage a viewer that exists within the browser itself. You can see here I've got an attachment. And if I just click on the attachment, you'll see I get an, an error message. It says, please wait. Uh, the message is not displayed. It may be a problem with your PDF viewer, et cetera. That is the case. And in this case, there's a, there's a problem with my PDF viewer in that it's not able to open the, uh, the attachment in the way that we sent it from the application. What we need to do is actually download the attachment. So we click on the download, and then that will open in a format that we can read, which is the, oops, the PDF, the Adobe PDF Reader format. So there's what the form looks like once it's opened in Adobe PDF Reader. And from there, it's just a matter of filling out the requirements of the form. So I'm gonna fill in my costs here, you know, measures required. I've got a lead time field that I need to fill in. And then I, if I have any exceptions on, the, uh, on my quote, I can add those here. I'm gonna add uh, both lines. I'm gonna put uh, 50 cents each on that one. And exceptions and here I can add some comments uh, I choose to oops and I can put my name here and then as well if I need to attach files I can do that I just click on the attach files and attach as many files as I like if I'm all ready I just click to submit the quote response and I'll click there. I should see in a very short time period, I should see a splash screen that tells me it was successfully received. That's my instant feedback. If I had left any of the fields blank or if I had entered any information incorrectly, I would have seen a message here telling me just what to do to, uh, to finalize my submission correctly. And as well, as soon as I do that, at least very shortly thereafter, I'm going to receive a confirmation note back from the application. So very simply, I don't have to call anybody or check to see if uh, my response has been received. All goes well here. I should get an email back. Way too long. And there we go. There's my notification and my confirmation back. And again, if I try to preview this form simply by using the preview, um, you'll see I get this message again, which tells me that I can't open it in the preview mode. Even within Outlook, I still need to open the form. And once I open it, now it will open in the reader. And I can see my submission and as well my confirmation number there at the uh, base of the form in case I need to refer back to that later on in the process. So that's basically the process from start to finish. As a supplier, very simple. Uh, the, only, the only problem I may have is if I try to open the document in a, in a tool or in a browser viewer that doesn't recognize the form as it's received. So that's about it. Thank you for listening.